Hello and welcome back to the left side of reality. This is your host as always, Snow the First. And last we streamed, we began to pick off the various social links and other business we have. Now that we have 20 days to play around with, we burned through half that time. And for this stream, we are ideally going to burn through the other half of the 20 days, starting with Marie. No, I didn't mean to do that. Come outside with me. Let's go. Good start. Yo. Oh, everyone's showing up again. Oh. Well. That didn't have much substance. Oh, welcome home, big bro. Uh, let's see. Who can that paladin armor go on? It can go on Yosuke. We can figure out the rest of the armor situation later. I was debating it with myself and previously I had decided to skip Sayoko in order to read the speed reading book, but I'm walking back on that. Especially when we're so close to maxing out Sayoko, I feel like the best course of action might be to actually finish her off, if at all possible for this chunk of time, and same with Nanako. Now, if there's time when neither Nanako or Sayoko is around, that's where, when we're going to read the hyperspeed book. But for now, we have a devil to court. I feel like we're going to max out Courage very soon, because we've been doing Sayoko so often. But we rank up anyway. Denote that we had zero dialogue options involved in that, so we're gonna have to hang out with her more before we can get to the next rank. Goodbye now. And that is exactly what made me decide to, um, dedicate this time to her. Oh, it's raining. That's going to limit our options severely.
Let's see. I'm gonna swing by Junez briefly. See if Yosuke is available. That's a no. Well, if no one's available, I'm probably going to swing by the um, Ayas to do the bowl challenge. I have the money for it. I just got 5000 from the hospital. Yeah, there are some small things that's inconvenient about the country, I would say. This is why I can't hold on to money longer than a, a, a minute. Understanding, knowledge, courage. Good spread. Welcome back. Ooh, we can spend time with Sayoko, but we can also spend time with Nanako. I'm pretty sure we can spend time with Sayoko tomorrow. So... <gasps> Nanako time. Oh, Nanako's not ready anyways. Yeah. But she will be next time. This is why I was confident I could, um... Uh, get through 10 days easy. Let's do the same thing again. I do this every so often, but I always need the reminder. Let's see, four courage, four knowledge, four understanding, three diligence. So diligence is the one weak point at the moment. Goodbye, gas station attendant. I feel like most people would explode from consuming this obscene amount of food. Knowledge, courage, hello, and diligence. And now, the weather. The week ended on a wet note as rain clouds moved into the area. As a result, a thick fog is expected to form in the Inaba region later tonight. Time to do our tradition of checking the Midnight Channel. Oh, that means we can't actually visit Sayoko. That bites. Uh, good thing I did her event when I could then. I think we might have two or three more chances to go with Sayoko before the plot kicks in in earnest. But then again, I focus on her a lot at night regardless. Okay, good to confirm that there are no victims.
Sea time. We sure do. Mm, tomato. Could always do with some more SP healing, even if it's minor. Anyway, just to confirm... We have maxed out courage. We just need knowledge and understanding, and then we hyper focus on diligence until we get that too. I think the reason why I maxed out on courage so early is because there were those times when I checked the fridge and ate whatever random garbage was in there. Oh no! Hurry, let's go. So, in other words, um, It seems that um, courage is the one of the easier um, stats to level up because um, there are so many ways to up courage. Let's see. Are there any clues? It's made of bamboo. Is that so? I would say they're the ones most likely. We're probably better off asking Kanji's mother than Kanji himself. Yo. Oh, senpai. Huh? We have business here. Rise, please simmer down the jealousy. This. Anything will help, Kanji. Uh, maybe? So you're saying it's an ornamental comb, more like?
Don't cross Kanji's mother. That's very pleasant, I say sarcastically. I'm doing some mental calculations in my head, and the 20th is when the beach trip happens. And it's gonna be next Saturday, so... Yeah, I think we might barely squeak by on completing Sayoko. All right, finally, we're, we're getting, we're entering the latter half for Marie. They really expect you to hang out with Marie a lot, incidentally, because for the next two ranks, there's no points that you can get which means you're expected to hang out with her a lot to build up those points. Well, see ya. Wow, what a great spread. I've never seen so many pieces of fatty tuna. Well, if you're gonna have a celebration, you can't do it halfway. Celebration? Ah. It's about this. Watch. I didn't care who it was. I was pissed off. I wanted to be famous. The suspect was often heard saying these things. Kubo. The young suspect has confessed to being the culprit behind the recent cases, but he's shown no remorse so far. Because of several inconsistencies in the boy's deposition, some have called for a mental examination to be carried out. Honestly, that's probably the most useful thing you could do for him. Until then, the police will be continuing their investigation to shed light on all the prior incidents. It was actually really tough to make a case out of this. All we had was the suspect's confession and some circumstantial evidence. But the lab found the perp's prints on the victim's clothes, so we made it stick after all. Man, isn't crime scene investigation something? Who would have thought you could get viable prints from cloth? You can, you can get fingerprints from anything if media is to be believed. There's no more scary stuff to worry about. You're safe now. Uh-huh. Man, that guy was twisted. A high schooler committing multiple murders and leaving the bodies like that. He was over the edge. Good thing we caught him. Now I can stop seeing suspects in every shadow. If the killer was still on the loose. Enough, Adachi. If you keep running your mouth, the sushi's gonna dry up. <laughs> oh, you're right. Sorry. Come on, everyone. Eat up. Well, since you asked... Huh? You don't like sushi, Nanako-chan? <laughs> 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 No, oh, don't know what's going on with me right now. Bear with me. Oh, that's right. I forgot to tell him to hold the wasabi. Here, I'll take it off for you. Which one do you want? Hmm? Halibut. Excellent taste, Nanako-chan. As for me, I'll go for sea urchin. Hey, 
There's only one of those. Too late. First come, first serve. I wonder if this means Dojima's gonna start showing up again. Unfortunately, he's gonna have to wait in line. I have no idea what Sagaki Rice does, but on the other hand, buying the bat now might give me a weapon so that there's one last less thing to worry about when I'm outfitting the party later. Bat. All right, what are we going to do on Sunday? Sunday, Sunday. We have Marie again as an option, and she has highest priority right now, so off we go. You're late. Hurry, let's go. Back here. She never saw anything like it. I don't get it. Their antiques is the implication. Oh, there are points you can get here. The guide is a dirty liar. We do, actually. They're surprisingly useful. Oh. Oh. No. Don't think about it too hard, Marie. Please. <laughs> oh, instantly shot down. We're doing research.
We want to learn about it. Ooh, boo this man. So, Daidara seems to support the idea that this is an ornamental comb. That might be perhaps the most useful information we've gotten yet, especially considering how many otherworldly materials we hand this guy on a regular basis. Ugh. Oh? Don't strain yourself. Take it easy. Interesting. So there was one opportunity to gain points during that whole, this whole scene. There may have been more, but I missed them because the guy doesn't tell me anything. Well, at the very least, if anyone is looking to this as a guide, I can show one place to get points in this rank. At the very least, my intuition leads me correctly sometimes. You're back. Ah, so Dojima is here now. But do we even have a Hierophant? We do not. So the next question is, would it be worth it to go get a Hierophant? Because all the personas we have right now are being used in active um, social links. Not to mention, to summon a persona costs money, and we're kind of running low on that. Hmm. <laughs> Missing a chance to talk with Dojima, though. That doesn't sit right with me. Wednesdays, Thursdays, Fridays. I'm going to take a calculated risk. For the time being, I'm going to get rid of... No, 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 no. For the time being, I'm getting rid of Ukobok because he's not going to be useful for anything until Wednesday. And then I'm grabbing a Hierophant and hanging out with Dojima. Okay, here's a relatively cheap, cheap Hierophant.
I am bad at math, which means I might fall prey to that one meme you see around sometimes. I took a calculated risk, but man, am I bad at math. Hello! 40,000 yen? I actually needed that! Hey! Ah. When you can, make a point to, um... When you can, make a point to get the top scores at every exam. We got a super powerful accessory from Nanako and 40,000 yen from Dojima. Being the top student pays dividends. Hey, it's me. Do we really want to give up our daytime slot for all those days? <sighs> we don't actually have a choice. Ah, uh, I wanted to check. I wanted to hang out with Eri too. Yosuke, why are you like this? We have a mascot, and we have Chie. Mm. We- uh, MOTHERFUCKER! I- Apologize for that outburst, but I didn't realize it would just eat all those days and nights without telling me. My opportunity to finish with Sayoko. Just... Dust. It dissolved into dust. Teddy is dead. Also, I may never forgive you for this, Yosuke. All, all that time. Gone. Well, they look yummy. We've got veggies. We sure do, Nanako. Uh, wall paprika. Those could be useful.
funny. I remember this festival being a lot more crowded. Is it because... Yeah, there ain't that many people here this year. Well, I guess you can't blame people for being scared. Haven't seen the reporters around either. They sure are good at stirring shit up and then disappearing. Well, it ain't so bad to have thin crowds. What is important right now is that we go get some ikiyaki. Ooh, I want to get some too. Kanji, what's ikiyaki? I'd like to know too. I don't know what that is either. Oh, we don't actually get an answer. Man, they're late. Why were they meeting up at Yukiko's house in the first place? They'll show up sooner or... Whoa! Isn't that them? Sorry we took so long. It took us some time to get dressed. When you think of summer festivals, you think you gotta... You have to wrap towels inside so they're not as breezy as everyone says. It's kind of hard to walk. <laughs> oh, that might That's actually be useful. So cute. I'm head over heels for you. Shut up, Teddy. <laughs> Thank you. How do we look, Senpai? Does the sight make your heart skip a beat? None of this actually matters, not the least which being because I'm pretty sure we're already set to... Actually, are we ready for Yukiko? I'm not entirely sure. We haven't hung up with her in a while. Oh, not at all. You're probably just used to seeing me in one. Kanji, what are you looking away for? Don't tell me you're ashamed to look. What are you, a monk? Th that ain't it! <laughs> You're so cute, Kanji. Hey, thanks for looking after her. They bought me cotton candy! Now, Toad, that bag is half as big as you are. Did they now? Alright then. You want to go over and do the target prank? Uh, I mean, game with me? I'll take care of Nanako from here. It's only a few times a year that this town gets charged up like this. You kids should go and have fun. Hmm. A summer festival. Hmm. A couple walking together at a festival. Unused to wearing it, the girl's yukata comes loose. Summer has begun. Someone get me a hammer to punk this guy in the head with. What kind of tagline is that? We gotta go two by two. Rawr. Two by two? See, I've been thinking. It's the summer, you're wearing yukata, and we're at a festival. It's just wrong for guys and girls to walk around in a huge group like this. We should couple up while we're here. It's the natural way of things. Teddy, you've been in this world for less than a month, I'm pretty sure. What, what the hell are you babbling about? I'm with Teddy. Come on, senpai. Why wear yukata in the first place? So we have memories we can remember fondly, right? So we should pair off right away. I know what you're Please thinking, Risei. What a terrifying girl! And the answer is no. You got a point, though. Good memories. Uh, I'm fine, too. Oh, what I mean is, uh, count me in. <laughs> All right, you guys decide how we'll split up. Huh? Seriously? It's up to us? Uh, all right. Three guys and three girls, what should we do? Three guys? <laughs> Aren't you missing one? What? <laughs> Me, him, and Kanji makes three. Ouch. What? You did that on purpose. Um, should I really do this? 
Oh yeah, you can barely look at him. No way. I can look at him. It'll be a cinch. Just you watch. Nah, you should bail, Kanji. It'd be best for everyone that way. What? You don't believe me? Well, I've made my decision. Hey, wait till we're done for that. I want Chie-chan and Yuki-chan and Rise-chan for my partner. That is not remotely how any of that works. That's not a decision. Dude, you're the one who said we gotta pair off in the first place. I ain't joking here, Ted. If you try and butt in on this... That's right, Kanji. This is serious business, and you're a true man. A true man wouldn't be prancing around with other girls at a place like this. Uh, okay. How much more can you butter him up? Kanji, this is a test to see if you can uphold your status as a true man. You know, times like this actually get across the point that Kanji is the youngest in the group because he's way too naive and gullible to all these people around him that are older and just kind of pull him around. <sighs> now no one will be left out. Yeah. You're right. Thanks, Teddy. You said it. Okay, count me out. Dude, come on. Don't fall for that. It's decided. I'm going with all of you. Huh? What's going on? Oh, there are too many guys, so someone would have been left out. I just couldn't let that happen. What? You little... <laughs> I see. You're so kind, Teddy. We let them decide and this is what we get? <sighs> what a letdown. Oh well, let's go then. We fail, huh? We hope you've enjoyed No Moral Theater, ladies and gentlemen. An epic fail. What's with this? Hey, Ted! Hands off my corn! Teddy, you got ketchup on my yukata! I said no earlier, Risei, and I meant it. Hello, it's me. Hi. If you're thinking I should get more points with, um, if you were thinking I should get more points with Rise, then keep in mind, I haven't actually done any social link with Rise yet besides the first. This place looks pretty dead. I thought there'd be more to do. Oh well. Why don't we start off with candy apples? Oh, wait. Before we do that, we should make a wish at the shrine. Why are you making that face? It's common sense. You're a country girl at heart, aren't you, I? So, what are you going to wish for? You. You, you don't have to wish for that. What a weirdo. All right, let's make these wishes.
Now it's time for those apples. Hello there! I got the best candy apples in town. Hmm? What a beautiful lady you have there. You must be lucky. I'll add a lottery ticket for each item you buy. Huh? You'll get a chance to draw a lottery at the Tori when you buy something from the stands here. Come to think of it, I'm not sure what her what eyes festival item is because I don't think I've ever seen anyone go for it. The prizes range from cheap trinkets to fabulous, magnificent items. All right, I'll give it a try. Now that I's gotten a chance to speak for extended, um, extended amounts of times, I can really hear the Julianne Taylor in it. Like I can hear bits of Tenko every so often. Give me ten candied apples. Can I get ten orders of Okonomiyaki, please? Hi, are you going to be able to eat all this? Hmm, goldfish scooping. Let's see how many we can catch in 30 tries. <laughs> Closer to Tenko in personality too, because look at this nonsense. Hmm, you've got, uh, whoa, 50 tickets. Thanks for your support. I'll go get the lottery box. This has to be the most fun I've had all stream. No way I'm wasting my time doing 50 draws. How about you do it for me? Make sure you get the grand prize, though. Aye, how, how the fuck am I supposed to do that? Close your eyes and draw your prize. Congratulations! You've drawn the grand prize! Yes! What is it? The grand prize is... a bale of rice! <laughs> <laughs> a bale of rice? I don't want it. Too heavy. W what? It may be heavy, but rice is a nutritious part of a balanced meal. Well... here. How about this instead? It's a coupon you can use at the Inaba Shopping District. Better than a bale of rice. Thanks. I'll give the other prize to you. Here you go. The Divine Way. Hello. Well, we better get home. Hi, Ebihara. You're a real darling, and it's such a shame that no one else can seem to see that. But on the other hand, more of you for me. I had a blast today. See you later. You know, the more time I actually spend with Aya Bihara, the more I feel like it was actually a fantastic, fantastic decision to focus on her for this playthrough. All right, Tanaka, what have you got for me? Hmm... 20... 20 soul tomatoes would be good for SP restoring, but on the other hand, I'm very terrible at catching bugs, and the, and the tomatoes are something you can grow for much less money, so... Beetles it is. Anyways, you just want to check something real quick. Knowledge and expression. Don't really need the expression, but the knowledge will help. Anyway, that wasn't the thing I wanted to check. No, it, it was one thing I wanted to check. The other one was... 
There's nine prize stickers? I haven't been paying attention to that at all. Perhaps fittingly, absolutely nothing of this went as planned. Oh. Yes, give me the melons. And then some walled paprika because why not? I just realized that, in an ironic way, getting rid of the Devil Persona was actually the smart thing to do, because I got precisely zero hangouts with Sayoko, and I got the one hangout with Dojima. Well, it's Monday and Marie isn't here. You know the rules. That means it's... Airy time! We're wrestling, apparently. Oh, bye, Ari. Just apologize. She doesn't hate you. The big problem is that these two have not talked with each other because they have completely incorrect views of each other that would be fixed if they just talked. <laughs> I am not his mother. You're his mother. Halfway there. Yukon, let's go home. You're back. We're actually getting near stream end time, so we're, I'm gonna call it soon. But first, I want to check something real quick. I can never find this when I'm actually looking for it. Let's see. The last job on the list, tutor. High understanding. We need max rank understanding in order to do that. So not yet, not quite yet. 
the other other thing I wanted to check. Where did you mail off the price stickers again? I have more of them than I know what to do with. Nope, I think right here. No, 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 not, not the shop, the mailbox. Uh, rare combo. Let's start redeeming those. Anyway, I'm pretty sure that once we... I'm pretty sure that next time we stream, there's gonna be a lot of plot. So it's perhaps for the best if um, we quit now. So we have all of next stream to basically face the inevitable cutscenes. I await your return to the left side of reality.